So with these small and very intricate sculptures, so that's less than the size of my hand, and you can see all of the details of this jewelry. And more than that, there are gaps. There's a space behind here. Let me see if I can show you that. Completely hollow from there, from under there, totally hollow behind. And people have wondered how they were able to do all of this in stone. Well, actually this is built out of soapstone or chalk stone which is very, very soft when it comes out of the ground. And when it's exposed to air and weather, that's when it hardens. So all of these carvings were done when the stone was quite soft. And everything here has been put together using an interlock method. There's no cement of any kind, no adhesive being used. And here we can see an unfinished section. So the stone looks like this. And they find the part that fits of the correct size and they make sure that it's been locked in and then they begin doing all of the detailing so look at that an expert was at work at this and had to stop probably because of the invasion <laughs>